Creating objects in AutoCAD is made easier by selecting the correct settings. Probably the simplest ones to look at are Snap and Grid. Let's toggle Snap on and give it a setting of 0 0.25. I like to keep Snap half of the grid spacing. In this case they are equal. Click on OK and let's draw a line. First line starting at 0, 0. Because Snap and Grid are on, it's very easy to place these values. A length of 10 units vertically upwards 5. Now I'm going to use direct distance for the next line 4.15. The next one is an angled line. The length of it is 2. Press the tab key and key in the angle value of 135. I'm going to toggle ortho on for the next stage. It makes it just a little easier. One line and close that. Right click and enter. Now what we want to do are draw a series of circles at an angle of 45 degrees. So I'm going to erase those lines and look at some other settings that will help us do that. The settings we want to look at are polar tracking. I'm going to toggle polar tracking on. I could do this also at the status line. 45 degrees for my increment angle. Change that to track using all polar angle settings and leave the other one as the default. The first circle will be placed at 0, 0, and it has a radius of 1 unit. Now to place the second circle, I simply hover over the center and drag along at the 45 degree angle, a distance of 5 units away, and the same radius of 1. Now I can repeat that workflow for the other two circles. So by using polar tracking, placing these circles is much easier and finish off with the last and fourth circle. Five units, radius of one.